Welcome back to GamecocksOnline.com. I'm joined by head volleyball coach Tom Mendoza after the Gamecocks sweep the weekend series with Cincinnati with a big 3-0 win today. And coach, it seemed like a masterclass on what volleyball looks like when you serve tough and you serve clean. It seemed like Cincinnati was on their heels all game and it showed on the scoreboard. Yeah, we had quite a few rotations that were really putting pressure on them, especially for a team that likes to get the ball to their middles as much as Cincinnati does uh, when we can serve as aggressively as, and consistently as we serve today. Uh, it makes it hard to do that. And so, um, you know, credit, there were quite a few. Camilla was one. Uh, Jenna was going on runs in her rotation. We could probably list, list quite a few people, but um, that's the way that we can put pressure. That, then you get them on a system and our block and our defense get a chance to set up. Uh, and then I thought our setters were doing a great job getting the ball to our hitters in transition. So, um, you know, this is the way we envision being able to score points on serve. Obviously, it's not always going to go as well as it, as it did at times tonight. Um, but, um, you yeah, know, it's, it's, it's st certainly a step in the right direction. Obviously, home wins are great. Winning on the road is still something you guys got to prove. But what was kind of the biggest lesson that you think the team took out of these two games? I think just how we're going to be successful as a group. And, and you know, and when we're recruiting, when we're talking to you know transfers, uh, and we're saying, okay, how is the group going to fit together? How are we going to be successful uh, on on the national stage? And when we get into SEC play, uh, we know the capabilities that all of these players have you know they are getting to know each other but how the pieces are going to fit together i think with every match we we see a little bit more of what that potential can be uh, we still have a couple players that are that are injured that we're trying to get back into the mix as well um, but i think you know we're learning how we're going to win uh, against good teams, and, and I think every time we, we um, are able to take a step forward like this, uh, it, it makes a big uh, difference, and hopefully now we take that belief with us on the road as well. Um, because, yeah, we can, we can be this hard to, to side out against. Uh, our serve receive numbers have been pretty consistent, uh, and, and you know if we score, uh, especially on the pins like, like we have been, um, you know, that's, that, that, that makes us a tough team to play. And uh, so, yeah, we, I still think we can get our middles more involved. We're, we're going to keep working on that this week. And, um, but, yeah, every, every little area of, of weakness that we can find in our game, we want to address and make it a strength. Uh, and hopefully we'll see that in results. How much did the passing help uh, on our side of the net, both with serve-receive and then just being able to dig up balls and transition, with, whether it was uh, Jenna, Camilla had some nice digs, even Jenna coming off the bench and getting some nice digs. It seemed like the team was really locked in, uh, reading the block and, and getting good digs off of that. How important is that to fuel the offense and be able to keep the defense off balance with the three options that we have up front? Yeah, I think Cincinnati was uh, mixing in the, the depth of serve pretty well. You know, there were some balls that were hitting the back end line, and there were some balls that were making our, our passers have to move forward to play it. So, um, you know, I thought for the most part, our, our, our passers did a really good job. Our platforms were looking good. So it was just really just about if they were tracking the ball well. Uh, and again, I think for the most part, we did that well. Uh, but yeah, defensively, I think, you know, Jenna's, Jenna had a pretty special weekend. Well, both nights she looked very comfortable uh, and was making a lot of plays, not just getting the ball off the ground, but putting us in a really good uh, opportunity to transition. Uh, and I thought our setters were getting their feet to those digs really well and, and then giving, giving us multiple options in transition attack. So, um, you know, she's, she's a really good player. And, and um, you know, and I think we're trying to figure out exactly, um, like I said, Yesterday, which you know, how much area we wanted to um, feed to her, you know, so that it's not they're not having a ton of court, but but the, we're allowing her an area of the court to dig. So, and I, I thought her serve that that's the one area of her game that I think she she could have been more impactful than, than maybe the first couple of weeks, and and so it's great to see her have such a good serving weekend.